Magandang araw! Good day everyone! I am AJ Pedernal and on behalf of Lakbay Pinoy Travel and Tours, let us accompany you to the most pristine and one of the cleanest lakes in Laguna, Pandim Lake. Pandim Lake is situated at Barangay San Lorenzo in San Pablo City. It has a maximum depth of 200 feet and is said to be the most pristine lake among the seven lakes sitting in San Pablo City. San Pablo is just two to three hours of travel from Manila. Prepare yourselves for a relaxing escape from the city and bonding with nature. The excitement on your faces cannot be hidden, so let me introduce myself again. Remember my name, I am AJ, and I am so honored to guide you all the way to San Pablo. Beside me is our travel chauffeur, Mr. Will. Mr. Will has five years of experience in this field. Can you say hello to Mr. Will? Excellent! Now please let me have a head count. One, two, three, ten. Fantastic! Tourist first is the slogan of Lakbay Pinoy Travel and Tours, so we are always observant and we ensure that your safety and satisfaction are our utmost priority. Now please take note of the following reminders I am about to ask you so our tour will have a smooth flow and precautionary measures for you to avoid getting into contact with the COVID-19 virus. First, please be mindful of all your belongings. Make sure to keep wearing your face mask while we are inside our bus and sanitize your hands frequently. If you're not feeling well, we have here a first aid kit. Second, please be conscious of the time so we can maximize our tour. We will be given four hours to experience this adventure, so take as many photos as you can, but remember to protect your gadgets with waterproof covers and laces as we are allowed to swim in the destination. Third, please be responsible for your trash. We do not intend to harm the environment of our destination, rather, we want to contribute to preserving it. Fourth, please do respect the rules and regulations of our destination as well as their culture. Refrain from shouting, otherwise we will disturb other tourists and living creatures. Fifth, socialize, make friends with other tourists as well as be kind to the locals. And lastly, don't forget to smile and enjoy this tour. Today is April 15, 2022, Friday, and for our weather forecast, it is 30 degrees Celsius. For our time check, it is already 9.30 in the morning. Please anchor your clock with mine so we won't have conflict in our schedule. Thank you, everyone. Our tour bus will be arriving approximately two hours from our current location. Please sit back and relax as we go along with our journey. Hey everyone, we are now arriving at San Pablo City. In just a few minutes, Pandin Lake will embrace us with its beauty. Prepare your swimming attires and cravings as we approach our destination. Here it is, my dear tourists. Let your sight roam around at the natural attraction we just landed in. How breathtaking, right? As you can see, there are staff making brooms out of coconut leaves and you are welcome to buy those as souvenirs. Look around and you can see that there are also different plants grown in coconut husks by Marco Ting. This shows that the place really advocates for the environment's beauty. Now everyone can take your time to change into your swimwear while we are waiting for the food to be prepared by the staff and arrange the bamboo raft we have chosen. Please gather around here right after. Let's go and ride onto the raft carefully and place your baggage on one side. As you can see, the food setup contains fried tilapia, shrimp, rice, free bottled water for everyone, and their specialty which is paco salad or fern salad. There is also buku juice and other desserts to be brought through the other side of the lake. While enjoying your lunch, you can feel that this place is located far from the city where noise pollution is widespread. Keep your stresses away and focus your thoughts in this paradise. Please also notice that there are only a few houses around it as the government implemented not to build more ones. Only the staff taking care of the lake, feeding the fish, and cleaning the bamboo rafts are allowed to stay in the houses. We also have two guides to help us in sailing through the lake, and one of them is a woman. Isn't it surprising? Women empowerment is proven here. Pandin Lake is one of the most sustainable destinations in the Philippines. It is not only protected by the staff, but also by the whole community. Another factful trivia is that the community has set a schedule of cleaning the lake. For example, every Monday, men will be the ones riding small rafts to roam around the lake or even dive into it in order to trace garbage and collect them for proper disposal. On the other hand, women will cook their meals and serve them after the said cleaning. They are also using recycled tires to create swings for the tourists and collect plastic every two days. Okay tourists, I know you are already loaded with information so you can enjoy your food, swim on the lake while wearing a life vest, and go swinging. Free yourselves but do not go too far from our raft. 
I will be raising this flag to indicate that we only have 10 minutes before we go back to the entrance. Savor the moment, everyone! Tourists! So, how many pictures have you taken so far, everyone? That was definitely a very memorable experience for you, right? But that, unfortunately, was the end of our trip. On behalf of Lakbay Pinoy Travel and Tours, I am AJ and we sincerely thank all of you for choosing us and traveling with us. We are looking forward to having another memorable trip with you. Mabuhay and God bless! Bye!